Hello everyone, Sigler here, Bork, Chef, you can call me whatever you'd like. So I have a question for you. Have you ever been like, run, like, let's say that you're doing a raid and the raid is like, okay, could you go healer for this one? Or could you go tank? Or uh, now I need your fire resistance gear. Wouldn't it be nice if you would be just, okay, let's say that I, uh, could you play uh, Shokadin for this, uh, or healer for this one? Absolutely. One press and you're done. And I have the, well, not the be best gear, of course. But I mean, it's equipped in like one go. <clears throat> or maybe it would be like, okay, uh, we're going to do a boss in BWL. Let's say fire maw and we need a lot of fire resistance. Of course, I can I can do that. Then, then it's fixed. Um, like, wouldn't, wouldn't that be nice if you could just set it up? So, or like, okay, I'm gonna boost and I press this button, or I press this button, or I press this button, or this one, or go back to Shokadin again. Wouldn't that be nice? Instead of being like, okay, uh, which piece is it? Uh, it's this one, and that, and this. I got a solution for you. And a lot, I, I know that a lot of people are playing with like a wardrobe or whatever it's called. I'm actually playing with item rack. So item rack is very simple to to get started and to just have the way you want. Basically what you do is like you you let's let's make a new one. Let's say testing video. And there. So let's say that I want for just for this uh, video I want to uh, whenever I'm pressing this keybound, for example, I want to uh, unequip all my gear. Uh, except shield, for example. And trinkets. Uh, let's do like this, if I can. There, there, there. And then save. So now, we will have it here. And what you can do after that is like press a keybind. Let's say numlock 6. And whenever I'm pressing it now, I will unequip everything. And if I press uh, my num lock number one, it's my gear that I'm using in BWL whenever I'm tanking. Since I have the full set now. Well, I, I'm missing the chest piece, but yeah, I got seven pieces now. So it, it's just a very nice and simple way to do it. So, and you can have multiple ones. Uh, the only thing that you have to keep in mind of is that, let's say I want to play my fire resistance gear. Uh, it's not actually correct set up. So let's see here. Uh, let's say that, uh, well, I know that the this one is better. This one is the highest fire resistance I got. So let's take that one. We want to change to uh, this one, Onyxia Scale Cloak, and then it's the, this one, and that's the best one. Got this one, and we want the Onyxia Blood Talisman that I got uh, yesterday, and the Blood Brood Mother. And if I want to, for example, I could change just to just change uh, this one, for example, to. This one, the title. I know it's not a tank one, but it's a fire resistance. So, and then after that, we can change this. Um, I'll, like, it's up to you. Uh, I mean, the two set bonus there is very nice. But if you really want the fire resistance, you can get five more there. Um, let's see here. I think that's the highest one, yeah. And then we got this thing, which is, this thing is way better. And then we've got this one. And when you're done, you're pressing save. And now whenever I'm, and I'm key binding it to numlock five. So whenever I'm like, okay, I've been tanking and then I want to change. I just press numlock five and everything should be there. And for example, like now I have 257 um fire resistance so it's just a very simple way for 
like gear management in your bags. It's it's so much like it's so good that it's like I cannot live without this anymore because I have so many different kind of things with me that I want for specific like different kind of things. So I mean it's yeah, it's just very simple to do. It's a I don't I really cannot live without. Me for example, I've gone into macros and I've created a macro which says um, forward slash item rack opt and whenever I'm clicking it, I'm opening in opening this thing. And sure, there is a lot of things you can do here. There's like like I've only scratched the surface of this add-on. I haven't really looked up in it, like into this, but I, according to my understanding, it be it could be like a specific set that you want to like equip whenever you are in a in a city. Let's say that you wanna uh, show off in your full tier two judgment or any tier two. You could set it to be like whenever you're in a city, you automatically equip it. I haven't really looked into it, but it looks like that's the thing. And like carrot on a stick or for mounting and everything. So, yeah, and the Onyxia Lair. I guess it's like the cloak, for example, like automatically. Uh, like whenever you're entering there, you could uh, like equip the Onyxia. The Onyxia scale cloak. So, yeah, it's just a very handy add-on that I personally cannot live without since I'm bringing so much gear with me to raids and everything and the reason also why I'm able to bring so much with me and still have bag space is because I have 20 slots bag it, I mean it did cost me a hefty amount of gold but in my opinion it's so worth it because I can like farm for longer I have more bag space for everything I can bring more stuff with me and don't be like okay I'd like I have a full bag for example and I'm doing a raid and let's say that in the end of BWL you have like three spots open uh, like slots in the bag and you're winning like 10 items well that would be insane for 10 items but I mean even so would be like okay what can I destroy so most likely you will like destroy elixirs or flask or consumes just to get the item and technically after a while that could be worth the same amount as a bottomless bag but yeah that's just me and uh, yeah if you can uh, see i'm trying to save a mustache because it's a no shave november to spread awareness to prostate cancer uh, my wife's father passed away in prostate, ca prostate, prostate cancer. I can't even speak right now. So, yeah, it's just to spread awareness to it. And, um, yeah, I hope this uh, add-on uh, will be helpful, helpful for you. I will uh, um, put it in the description below. I'll link to it. And, uh, yeah. And if you press on any of this video from the past... I'll greet you there with a Bork Bork. Consider to like this video and subscribe. And I'll see you over there. Bork Bork! <laughs>